Wrightsville Kids, I'm Pastor Julia. So recently, I have been looking outside at the church and seeing this really cool play structure. And at the top, there's something that I think could be a really cool clubhouse. Now, I was hoping to take you out there today, but it's raining, so I'll just have to tell you about it but I think it would be the perfect place for us all to get together and be friends and hang out. Doesn't that sound fun? So I think I'm gonna start a club and you're all invited. But as I'm thinking about this, I think if we're gonna have all of, all of us together in the clubhouse, we're probably gonna need some rules about how we're gonna get along together. What do you think are gonna be some good rules? I thought about maybe making it no boys allowed, but then I realized I have some friends who are boys and so I don't wanna do that. I think everyone should get to be invited. What do you think? Well, I think we should have a rule probably in case we bring our own toys that you can't take someone else's toy without asking. Does that seem fair? I don't like it when other people take my toys from me. And Maybe the same should be true if we brought snacks, that it's always good to share, but you can't take things without asking. And I think we're gonna wanna try and be nice to each other, right? So we probably won't have it be allowed to hit each other or, or anything like that. I think it'd be better if we made a rule that said we aren't gonna do that. I think those are some pretty good rules that we would have to be together. You know, this kind of reminds me of something that happened in the Bible. You see, God was getting together all of God's people, and he was kind of starting a club, if you will. And he thought that there ought to be some good rules in place to make sure that everybody could have fun and get along together. Some of the rules were about how everyone would live together. Some of them were like, don't take things that don't belong to you you know, like how we aren't gonna t steal each other's toys. And don't hurt other people. And remember that your family is really important. And then some of the rules were about how we should treat God. So you have to remember that God is the most important thing in the whole world. And remember that nothing else is as good as God. And remember that God's name is a really special word, and so we shouldn't use it like it's just any other word. All of these were things that God came up with so that we could live together well and have fun together, and so that we could love God. I'm really glad that we get to do that. Will you pray with me? God, thank you for making us your children. Help us to live in the ways that you want us to so that we can love our friends and love you. In Jesus' name, amen.